On April 21, 2004, a 51-year-old engineering technician was killed when he was backed over by a dump truck in a roadway work zone. The job site was an inner city street that was being resurfaced early in the morning. The victim was subcontracted by the employer to provide engineering assistance for the project. When he arrived on site, the victim was wearing dark clothing and not wearing a hard hat or any type of high visibility clothing. He began to take measurements of the amount of asphalt being removed in the same path as the milling process. The dump truck operator pulled into the job site north of the milling machine, made a three-point turn, and started to back towards the milling machine to wait her turn to be loaded. The operator honked her horn and continued to back towards the milling machine. As the truck operator began to back up, she struck the engineer while he was bent over taking a measurement. Emergency rescue personnel arrived shortly after the foreman called 911. They pronounced the victim dead at the scene. The following lessons learned are recommendations from the National Institute for Occupational Safety and Health. In order to avoid similar fatalities, management should consider the following. Ensure that all employees are wearing appropriate personal protective equipment, PPE. Establish a system to ensure the area behind and adjacent to vehicles and equipment is clear to safely operate, including using a spotter or operator inspection. In addition, workers should remember Workers should always remember to wear the proper PPE so operators of equipment and vehicles will be better able to see them.